What is up you guys? Today we are making the Outpost Mix Popcorn from The Sims 4 and it is also a real life Disneyland recipe. So if you haven't tried it, let's begin! Alright, so this recipe here that I found online is the closest one I can find to the actual recipe. It calls for grape purple glaze and red hot cinnamon glaze and chili powder. Now I couldn't find really any of those. So what I ended up getting was purple sugar. So it's not gonna taste like grape, but it is gonna taste like sugar. To be honest, I don't think I'd like grape popcorn anyways, but whatever. I got some cinnamon sugar instead of the red hot cinnamon glaze. So I'm making my own red hot cinnamon glaze. I have cinnamon sugar mixed with chili powder, and that's gonna be the red hot cinnamon glaze. And each of these is gonna be each flavor and then we're gonna put in some of the regular tasting popcorn into each and then put it in, mix it all up, and voila! We got our outpost mix, so let's begin. So I don't have a microwave, so I have no way of melting the margarine or butter. I just chose margarine because it's easier um, because we're gonna mix this in to make it liquidy to make it stick to the popcorn. So like I said, I don't have a microwave, so what I'm gonna do is boil some water in my kettle and then mix it up in a little bowl and then we'll pour it in. I don't even know how much. Let's just go for it. Okay, that should be good. Okay, the sugar is dissolving. And it is turning purple. I mean, there's still margarine chunks in there still. There's definitely still some undissolved sugar. But that's pretty good. So I'm gonna try and pour it on the popcorn. Wish me luck. Actually, before I do that, I don't know, it's kind of watery. So I may maybe wanna add a little bit more margarine to it. This just kind of looks nasty. It's just sugar and margarine. But actually that kind of sounds good too. I guess that plan didn't work out because I'm just adding more water now to melt that margarine that I just put in there. But it melted really nicely. So I'm gonna add more sugar. I'm gonna probably, yeah, let's add more. So pretty. Oh my gosh, look how purple that is now. That's really pretty. We've got lots of margarine in there. So I think we are ready to pour the mix over the popcorn for our first flavor. And can you guys see it's actually changing the popcorn? It's also kind of melting it. <laughs> I don't know, like, is this hot? I'm gonna taste it. Oh, that's awful. <laughs> that's awful. Ugh. That just tastes like margarine. A very sweet margarine. Oh my, what have we done? It's definitely melting the popcorn. Like, we're gonna have to add more. I guess maybe to prevent it from melting, what we would do is just let it cool down. So, okay. Maybe we're gonna do that for this, uh, this second, <laughs> like the second, like, set, second set that we added in here. Let's let that margin or that cool down. And then we're gonna start with the second flavor while that one cools down. So this one is the uh, the spicy cinnamon. The it's kind of supposed to taste like maybe cinnamon hearts. I don't like cinnamon hearts. I don't think I'm gonna like this recipe, even though I know it's not even like close to what it's supposed to be. But 
You gotta do with what you, uh, you gotta work with what you got, right? I mean, look at us. We are stirring water into margarine because I cannot afford a microwave. <laughs> all right, so we got our liquid base. Now it's time to add all of the sugar. Well, not all of it. Okay, so we're gonna start with the, uh, what is this, chili powder? I don't want to do too much. I feel like that's probably good. Ooh, that is strong. That is a smell that I do not want in popcorn. And now the cinnamon sugar. I'm actually excited to try this. I'm going to try this stuff on its own. Mmm. Tastes like cinnamon bun. Yummy. Okay, let's add like lots of this one. I think I'm going to like this one. Okay. And if it's not spicy enough, we can always add more. Um, what was it? I always forget what it is. Chili powder. Ah! Getting it everywhere. Let's lick it. Taste test. Hmm. Yeah. Not getting a lot of heat right now. Not a lot of spice, so we might have to add a little more of that. That was a lot. And honestly, I'm gonna add a little bit more cinnamon sugar. Ready? Oh, we don't. We gotta let it cool. I forgot. Okay. So, now that this one has been cooling for a little bit, let's add it to our popcorn. I mean, it's still kind of shrinking, but you get the picture. It's just a absolute gooey mess, but that's fine. Okay, now we have one flavor done. Now let's get the other flavor going. This is actually looking like the recipe, so that is exciting to me. Shake it up, add some more. We're just doing all of it. <laughs> Get in there. And we're gonna mix. Woo! One got away. Okay, I am gonna try them both separately before I mix them together. So here's what they both look like. Let's try it. <laughs> this is so sad. Ooh! Hey, that's really good. That's like really sweet. I like it. Okay, we're gonna try one of these ones. Mmm. Holy shit. I fucking like it. <laughs> Who would have guessed? Most certainly not me. Okay, so I'm gonna do this. We're gonna have to mix it together. So I'm gonna mix this one in here. Then, I'm gonna put plain popcorn in here. Mix these two together. So they're kind of mixed and then I'm going to mix it in with my regular popcorn as like a blend you can see that in the picture we're gonna put some more regular popcorn in there Woo! that's a lot popcorns getting away and we're gonna put some more in there I'm just gonna kind of strain the juice out a little if we can, just because we don't want the popcorn like too watery, even though it totally is. <laughs> I, I think if I were to ever do this again, obviously I would uh, tweak a couple things in the way that I did it. Actually, you know what? Let's just dump the juice in there. Let's add a little bit more popcorn just to garnish it. And voila! We have our outpost mix, guys! Look at it, look how freaking good that looks. Actually, that looks horrible, but it is so good. Now for the taste test. Okay, guys, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab a little scoop here with like one of each flavor. 
gonna grab a little brown one here. Another grape. Regular. It's gonna be messy, but here we go. Hmm. That is weird. It tastes like cinnamon bun. Sweet. And a little salty. Okay. There was like 1% chance of me that I thought I might actually like this. Even though I kind of totally did it wrong. I really like it. Mmm. Yeah. Well, would you, what do you know? Now, I don't know if I would like it with the grape, but maybe. Either way, it's purple, it's outpost, it works, and we did it. Cheers, guys. Let me know if you guys make this recipe too. Comment below if you do, or if you've ever had it. Comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video for next Food Friday. Bye, guys.